everybody. Hey, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Brandon, and welcome to Parma. Yep, and I'm Dot, and as you guys probably have seen us before on some of these and at the store. Um, today, we're, what we're going to do is we're going to just basically tell you a little bit about the girls, the pineapple packs, and our products. Mm -hmm. So we're going to start over here with Alice. So come on through and shop with us for a little bit. So we'll start out with our Alice's here. And our Alice is our staple pineapple girl. Uh, she starts out with our bonus quarters. As you can see here, you get five bonus quarters in a pack. And every pack you get comes with a free pattern. And, and that will show you those there. And so we have, I think we have like upwards of 20 different patterns for, for um, Alice. And as on line where you just pick it when you order something or here you just ask for it at the store yeah, when so, you check out yeah and when you when you choose your pattern you just let us know at the front desk and we'll pull that pattern for you uh, before you leave and okay, we'll right and then we, we have samples sometimes like this here is a little flannel blanket that was actually made and i believe this is yeah, what, it's the car quilt it's the car quilt and it's a it's really very sweet a great little baby project and again this can be made with any of the alice's on this tower so and a lot of this stuff is online some of it is the older stuff but um there's always new product coming so keep, all keep looking all the time so we'll move over to our bellas here just right behind you and here our bellas consist of our starter pack which is our five bonus quarters here in the back and then you'll see you also get 22 and a half inch strips and 22 and a half inch squares as well for this particular pineapple pack. Right, and it's five different fabrics repeated four times. Yes, and these are really great projects um, because you get a lot of different pre-cuts here and you can make a really a good variety of size projects uh, when you choose the Bella. And, and for example, you can make a table runner and four reversible placemats, mm -hmm. which is actually sampled here. And this we have we don't have the pack anymore but again we we can you can always make it out of any of the other bella packs we have bags farmer's market shopper quilts small quilts and this is a front back and binding quilt the hopscotch you can make a little kitty igloo for your kitty and there's just various other quilts that are really cute that you can make with bellas and I like, I personally like this project um, in the Nature's Notebook Bella pack. I think this one's a really fun one, very good for spring and nice if you want to do it outside of your picnic table or if you want to have it inside, maybe in your sunroom or something like that. Right. I think this is a great collection for that project. And it's, I believe that's uh, Nature's Notebook is Robert Kaufman. So, okay, so then moving on mm -hmm. to Carla. Let me take you over to our Carla's. And Carla, like our other girl, starts with our bonus quarters. So you have right. five bonus quarters here, and then you have 20 of our five by fives and 20 of our two and a half inch squares here as well to start your pre-cut project here. So the difference between Bella and Carla is you have a half a jelly roll in Bella and you have your five by five in Carla. So again, their project, it's a little bit smaller, but the other thing you can do is if you want to make a quilt bigger, you can buy two packs and make a bigger quilt. So you've got like some nice wall hangings, a friendship star, and this is a cool project for, for little kids just to put in the back seat of your car, the car caddy. It hangs over the headrest, which is kind of nice. And then one of our original projects was our butcher block, or butcher block, butcher apron and pot holders. Yeah. And then a cool bags and table runners and a really beautiful bag that we have here called the Simple Sack and another bag. So there's lots of bags and also some cool quilts. And you, you do get a lot of different crafty items in the Carla uh, pack, like the toddler nap mat. This is actually a pillow and it rolls up into the little nap mat and then you have little handles to carry it. And that's one of the things I love about the Carla is even if you're, a, if you're not a quilter, if you're just a crafter or just a sewer, you have a lot of fun projects and not just quilts in our Carla. It's a, it's a really diverse pack. 
Right, and the good thing about this is there's a little pillow in there, and you can take the pillow out, take yeah, wash exactly. the whole thing. Mm -hmm. And Brandon's very got useful, a little one; useful. he's going to be. Using I'm going to have to put one of these together myself you, here soon. That's right. So, all right, we'll go over to our Diana's next. Diana's just across, across I the way. Say my alphabet there for a second. <laughs> So we have our Dianas here, and our Dianas are slightly different. Our Dianas don't have our bonus quarters. These are actually 10 of our six and a half by 43 inch strips. And this actually makes for some pretty fun projects as well. We have um, some child's butcher aprons, just like we have our adult butcher apron, except this makes two. And here's one version of it here. And then you can see it made a completely different way with another pack here be great for little boys it's got your dinosaurs right. and you've got your geographic map of the world as well so it's, it's a really fun and project. it's kind of kind of like black lighty it's uh called uh late jurassic era so mm -hmm. it's a cute little project yeah i love that pack i really do like that collection together and then here are your patterns that we have again we have uh, this is a nice birds in flight quilt and pillow this is a diana <clears throat> and then you need to have some background fabric um, if you're gonna make this, then we have the little aprons we showed you. Another bag we have, we really do have some super cool bags at Pineapple. I mean, all different kinds of bags. And this is one of my favorite quilts. This is called the crisscross quilt. Just super fun and really bright and vibrant. But again, any of the packs can be made into any pattern that you have. And one last thing I'll show you quickly about our Diana is right here on the side, one of my favorite things about shopping in the store is you do get to see a lot of these examples in multiple collections. So here you can see our crisscross quilt, and this one is done in our hooked on a feeling pack. But then you can also look down here and see the same crisscross quilt in our city hoppers pack. And you can see how, how much variety there is just by switching which collection you create the project in. Exactly. And so depending on who you're making it for or if you're making it for a different season, it's very easy to switch your project for who you're making it for or when you're making it Exactly. For. It's, and, it's, and it's always fun for us when we see the finished projects mm. and say, wow, that looks incredibly cool. So, yeah. um, so then I guess we're going to move on to Franny. Yeah, we'll go over okay. to Fran. And there's Beth. Beth, say hi. There's Beth. Everybody knows Beth. Hello. Beth's helping today. She's working with us. So Franny is again a different, um, a different size pack. Uh, Brand, you want to take this one yeah. away? Yeah. So this one's just slightly different than our other packs as well. Uh, the Fran here has a set of 25 by fives. Then we have 22 and a half inch strips and 22 and a half inch squares as well. And this is one of our newer packs. This one's called America, as you can see, obviously, with America all over. This makes a really good project. A lot of red, white, and blue. If you're doing any Quilts of Valor projects or doing something for veterans or family members who have served, this is a great collection to go with for those projects because you can make backpacks, bags, all kinds of things. And, and God and will show you a few of those. We've got like a the little spinner quilt, which is actually super cool. And then the Karen Board quilt. And this one, the subway tiles, which is, I, I really love this. This was designed by Sue. You guys all know Sue. She's the pineapple peeps gal, and she also works in the store and does a lot of our sewing for us. So um, these are the Frans, and there's, there's more. I just didn't go through them, and these things are kind of cumbersome. And now what we'll do, we'll move over to our alley, which is on the other side of the room. So we'll head over to this tower. And... One of the things we love about the Ellie is once we get to this size project, we're making some really great size lac quilts um, and even quilts that would make good throws for your couch or even uh, for the end of your bed. So we have some really great projects here. You'll see another one where you can see the collection and we have our village square quilt here and that's made in our Mayflower couch. And then we have our shockwaves quilt made in music box as well. And you can just see, uh, you know, you just change up your collection here, even though they're two different projects, you can see how these fabrics are already coordinated for you. So no matter what pack you choose, all of your fabrics are gonna coordinate very well together once you start putting them together for your project. Yeah, and we really try to um, have different items offered. So like, for example, 
it's hard to find guy stuff. Um, so I, whenever we, whenever I can, I buy manly or little boy stuff. There's more stuff out there that's that's for girls. But gender neutral is very cool too. And we have a couple of cool examples. Um, I love this pack. This is um, by um, In the Beginning, and this is Dinosaur Friends, which actually, you know, little girls like dinosaurs too. I, I used to love them when I was growing up. So this is very cool. And then the different projects you can make, as Brandon said, there's a lot of good quilts. And this one is new, it's called Quilt and a Tote. So let's say you did go on a picnic or you went to the beach, you could pat, put your quilt in your bag and, mm -hmm. and go off to, as my sister yeah. did, took this picture in California. And I love it because it, it also makes the inside and out of the bag too. Right. So you don't have to worry about the quality of the project that you're making. Right. And in the store and online, we sell batting and all kinds of stuff. I don't know if we, we don't sell batting. We sell um, yeah, fusible. Yeah, we have fusible police. Fus fusible yeah. police, yeah. yeah. So there's placemats and then these little stuff bag. Um, so for like, you want to do gift bags, you can make a whole bunch of gift bags mm -hmm. or just use it for when you go on a trip for something. And then of course, other cool mm -hmm. LA quilts. Okay. Yeah. So you got a lot of choices with our Ellie. And as we said before, just add more packs if you want to make your mm -hmm. project a little bit bigger. Most of these projects are very simple to add on to. Maybe add a little more binding um, and bring or out a border your, maybe. Your border. Yeah, bring out your border a little bit by adding a little border to your binding there. And you can get you a good size quilt out of just one Ellie pack. And if not, you can always do two. And so we'll go over to our Grace who we have here next. And we'll show you a few of the projects that we have here. Um, our Grace, firstly, is uh, 10 pieces of our 12 inch by 43 inch fabric. So it's basically the width of the fabric by 12 inches. And you've got 10 of those pieces there uh, for these projects. Um, this makes a really good size quilt, just like our Ellie here, because you have a lot of, a lot of yardage inside of our Grace bag. And these do come with a pattern as well. And this one, my sister Vicki, who makes a lot of our patterns as well, she just made this in the aprons. So those are kind of perfect for this time of the year. Mm -hmm. If you wanna, if you're having a party or you just wanna have a nice, cool, fun apron at these home. Are, these are really cute. I love this little print. And you can't go wrong with little avocados and tomatoes no, avocados. and chilies with little faces. Ooh. This is really, really cute. Yeah, definitely cute. So again, with the, um, with the patterns, <clears throat> We have like a, a really nice little star gazer quilt. And then this is shop and style tote bag set. And the tilted quilt, which is this guy, which again is, it's cut up and it's sort of, um, <clears throat> it's just a really fun, fun quilt. And window pane, and these are the aprons. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's hard to see them, but they're, believe me, they're very cute. Yeah. And then the angled squares is another one. And then if you want to take a look, there's some, quilts over there that you can take some pictures of. They're all okay. grace quilts. And these are all with our grace pack. It's the window panes. And then this is our pinwheel, I believe the pinwheel waterfall pattern. And then we have our angled squares quilt. And our double four pack. And another great thing you'll notice in these projects is that some of these like here on the double four patch, it's a lot of small squares, but here in our angled square, we have a lot of different cut pre-cuts um, cut different ways. So you can get a simple quilt that's very easy for anyone, or you can go for something more complex if you're a more experienced quilter. So do keep that in mind with your patterns. You'll have notes such as confident beginner, um, intermediate and things like that as well on your pattern. So you'll know the, uh, the challenge that you'll have ahead as you're doing your project. Right, and just so you guys know, you know, we do have a lot of other products and we have um, 10 by 10s, jelly rolls, bonus quarter bundles, which are 21 by 21, like they are in the girls. Yeah. And they come in six counts all the way up to 14 counts. And every single product we have comes with a pattern except for scrappy bags mm -hmm. and, um, and scrap halves, scrap halves. Mm -hmm. but everything yeah. else you get a free pattern with. Right. So it's kind of a, it's just a fun little way of making a project. Yeah. And make sure that when you leave, if you don't have an idea of what you want to make, that you're at least inspired before you leave. Exactly. And so that you'll have some idea of where you want to go or what you might want to do. Exactly. So, so I guess that's it for today, right, Brian? Yeah. Okay. I think that's everything. All right. Well, see you guys later. Have a good day. Good to see you all. Bye. Have a good afternoon.